picking up a racing wheel for your PC setup can completely revolutionize your sim racing experience and add valuable immersion to more casual sessions as well. Whether you're after an all-singing wheel, loaded with realistic feedback and all the pedals, shifters, and displays you could ask for, or you're simply looking for a cheap wheel to get started, there's plenty of options on the market right now. If you are searching for a racing wheels, there are a few key features that you should be looking out for the top 5 best racing wheels that are available on the market. I tried to make the list based on their popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinions and more. If you need more information about these products, please check the link in the description section below. And make sure you subscribe to more videos. Okay, so let's get started with the video. Starting at number 5, Thrustmaster T248. With a massive selection of additional features, easy-to-reach button placement, and excellent force feedback there's plenty to love about the Thrustmaster T248. It's the brand's latest flagship setup, geared towards PC and PlayStation devices, and performed incredibly well in our testing. The spec sheet speaks for itself here, with dual encoder controls, magnetic paddle gear changers, and a LED telemetry display which can be used in a number of ways by titles like F1. There's plenty of room for customization in here. The brake pedal can be configured to four different pressure modes, and we did find some a little too stiff for regular play. You're also getting 25 remappable buttons and the LED display in the center can be configured to show you a range of stats in supporting games, from race position to lap time to gear number. At number 4, Thrustmaster TMX Force Feedback Racing Wheel. There's absolutely no question that force feedback makes a huge difference to how fun a racing game is. Having the wheel push against your hands with varying degrees of resistance when you crash or steer gives you a realistic feel and even evokes memories of arcade coin opus racers like Daytona USA. But the technology is expensive, meaning you need to be serious before buying. Or at least you did. Thrustmaster has produced a cut down, but still impressive force feedback wheel as an entry-level purchase, and it's very desirable indeed. The pedals included are plasticky, and offer little resistance, and don't include a clutch pedal either. However, they can be swapped out for a better compatible set if you decide to upgrade later on. The steering wheel is similarly low cost, and nowhere near as deluxe feeling as the high-end unit's interchangeable wheels. At number 3, Logitech G923 Steering Wheel and Pedals. Logitech has been in the steering wheel industry for around two decades now and as gaming technology has improved, so has the quality of their wheels. The G923 is a direct successor to both the Xbox Focus G920 and the PS version, the G29 both of which were compatible with PC. Now we've just got one device sold in two variants, again both of which are compatible with PC, and boy oh boy is it a corker. Steering wheels are typically aimed at either entry-level players looking to dip their toes in the water of sim racing, or hardcore racers who have been doing this for some time now, and the G923 caters for both brilliantly. The G923 also offers perhaps the most immersion you'll get from any wheel on the market thanks to the new True Force technology, while still keeping the price point below the upmarket costs. The price is steep if you're new to the scene, but it's less than its direct competitors and is one of the best when it comes to performance. It's well built with premium stitching around the leather, looks sleek with your setup, and is the closest you can get to experience what it's like to actually be behind the wheel of a supercar divided by F1 car, rally car without leaving the comfort of your desk or forking out some serious money for a full sim rig setup. If you've got the cash, the G923 is a beautiful bit of kit and a must-have if you don't already own a similar product. At number 2, Logitech G920 Driving Force. This Xbox One wheel is super smooth and feels superb to drive as a PC steering wheel too. It's ergonomic and pleasantly slimline, while retaining a good, solid feel. Aside from the same handbrake as a button problem as the Thrustmaster offerings, a unique area of consternation is the pedals. The unit we tried features an unusually stiff brake pedal, requiring immense pressure to get the brakes to engage. Reviews on Amazon suggest other people have the same criticism, something that isn't true of the PS4 equivalent G29. You can usually reassign the brakes to the clutch pedal, but that's not ideal if you're a serious racing fan. Things are improved somewhat if you mount the pedals properly on a racing seat or on non-slip flooring like carpet, but it really shouldn't be quite so stiff. 
At number 1, Thrustmaster T300RS Gran Turismo Edition Racing Wheel. All products in the T300RS series feature a quick and easy wheel-changing system, allowing users to enjoy racing using different Thrustmaster wheels. The ecosystem of Thrustmaster add-on wheels, composed of wheels sold separately without a base or pedals, offers T300RS users a wide selection of products specially designed for different motorsport styles. From GT circuit racing to rally racing on rough terrain, all options are open to Thrustmaster racers. Simply rotate the locking system on the base of the T300RS to remove the current wheel, in order to attach a new wheel to the base. The quick release system for the wheel only requires the use of a Phillips screwdriver for excellent long-term gaming stability. The brushless motor's endurance allows the racing wheel to maintain constant intensity and power in terms of force feedback, avoiding a loss of sensations even during very long gaming sessions. As opposed to brushed motors, this brushless motor technology provides stability and dynamic performance for the driver right through to the end of every race. Thank you for watching guys, I hope you liked this video, if this video was helpful to you please remember to leave a like comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos, if you have any question related to this product you can heave a comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible.